Welcome back to your live continuing coverage of Infocom 2015's digital signage stage on Beat Terrific. I'm Michael Artsis. This is your live official continuing coverage of Infocom's digital signage stage 2015 in the digital signage pavilion. Orange County Convention Center in Orlando, Florida. Infocom's amazing. Thank you so much for watching. You're the Terrifics and you make Be Terrific special. If you want to get in contact with us, it's simple. Go to beterrific.com slash Slack. Join our other Terrifics in our Slack chat by entering your name and email address. We'll send you a Slack invitation. You can ask questions, make comments in real time. Some of them will get on air and we'll be able to keep the conversation going 24 hours a day. Also on social media, at Be Terrific TV, on Twitter and Instagram and Facebook. And of course, you can email us. We love the feedback, keep it coming. Connect at beterrific.com. I've got a very special guest on right now. She is from a company I love. We use their products every day to do the live broadcast to you. The company is called New Tech. They make the TriCaster and a couple of other products. Her name is Ellen. And Ellen, thank you so much for joining us. It is such a pleasure to be here, Michael, thanks. First of all, thank you. You guys make some of the greatest products ever. We use the TriCaster Mini on a daily basis. I know we're going to talk more about that another day. We're going to talk about something else today, but thank you for being here. Thank you for uh, being involved with the digital signage stage. You're a sponsor. And also thank you for supporting us in this broadcast and bringing out a TriCaster 8000, which we'll get more to uh, you know, tomorrow when we, when we see you tomorrow. Well, you know, our whole objective is to put video in, uh, the power of video into the hands of more storytellers like you, broadcasters, independent webcasters, and anybody who wants to create their message in live video and share it with the world. So you've got one of your newest products is Talk Show, and it's really amazing because, you know, doing this broadcast, it's really nice, but sometimes we want to incorporate callers, we want to incorporate some of the terrifics, we want them to be able to uh, come in, and, and also we want to have uh, guests from all over, because why should I just say, you can only be a guest if you can come here, or you can come to our studio in New Jersey. That makes no sense for us anymore. And satellite time, wow, that's really expensive, and it's hard to do, you have to have satellite on both ends, and it doesn't really work. So you've come out with talk show, which basically gets rid of the need to have satellite both ways and makes Skype a very viable solution and it makes the quality of Skype better for audio and video and gives us a flexible solution better than the alternatives that we've tried to jury rig in the past. Yeah, talk show really is an answer to trying to jury rig uh, video calling production systems because um, you know, you, on the one hand, like you said, you have the broadcast trucks, the satellite time, the really high end expensive gear. But when you do have that kind of a scenario, you can control every aspect of the image. It can really create a professional product. And on the other hand, when you're using a free Skype client, like a consumer uh, software on a desktop or a laptop, then you're kind of at the mercy of whatever's going on um, at the uh, caller's end or with uh, the Skype client itself, and it doesn't look as professional. You might even get a call that interrupts you and pops up on the screen. We, we've had that in the past, yeah. uh, before using Talk Show, which we just started using in love. Uh, we had like messages people would IM you and all sorts of things they don't realize. And you, you know, you'd have to deal with all that stuff. It, it's, it was really a, a, a poor way of doing it, uh, and it never looked right. This is amazing. In fact, I don't know if you know this, but we just did this with Israel. Oh, this is crazy, but there's this great digital signage company that makes digital signage, kind of democratizing digital signage for the masses. They're called NoviSign, novisign.com. And I thought they were great. Last year I tried to invite them, and I got in contact with them too late. This year I tried to invite them. The invitation got lost in the email. Believe it or not, uh, without the uh, Pony Express, we still get uh, mail lost. When they finally got it, it was a couple days before Infocom, and uh, it would be too expensive to travel from Israel last minute. So uh, they, uh, and, and maybe next year they'll display here, I think they should, but uh, maybe they would have if they had known, if they had gotten the invitation. But anyway, um, we said, no problem, we'll Skype you and how's that sound? And uh, you know, we can show off some Novi sign and stuff like that. So that was amazing, we just did that. Well, talk show is really the next best thing to having uh, to fly a guest in and take that expense and those logistics. We have a, a little video clip so that we can show your watchers kind of what oh, the talk show system looks that's like. That's great, we've got a, a great crew back there. Can you guys run the video clip? Well, we, what New Tech has done is we've taken um, you know, the, the Skype TX from Microsoft software and built a uh, purpose-built broadcast hardware uh, for it to host it so that you had SDI video quality going to your uh, switcher um, coming from uh, any old Skype call. So a client anywhere in the world, like your caller from Israel, can use their uh, desktop, their laptop, their mobile device, 
even Xbox, any kind of device that, uh, that uses Skype client, the, just the consumer client, can dial in and then on your side, you have the talk show system and it is taking that video and we've put in all this new tech special sauce to enhance that video, enable you to control the lighting qualities of it, the color attributes of it, and just really make a good looking and good sounding image out of that call. And, and I think what's great is you can connect it in multiple ways. You can do SDI, uh, HDSDI, you can uh, convert that to HDMI, but you can also do it over network, which is amazing, and we've done that. And it's funny, you guys, when we got it, and, and you guys were like, hey, we're going to use it for uh, Infocom, uh, you know, you were like, hey, should we, ha should we walk you through setting it up? I said, let's try it ourselves. It literally took five minutes to get this thing working, and then we had a couple of questions, so we leaned on you. But it was, it, it was minor, and it was all set up and, and working perfectly. Uh, so that was great, it's, it's easy to use, and it's only one RU, it only takes up one rack space. That's right, real professional hardware system, and if you have your, uh, your guest set up on the other end with something like a green screen, you can even make it look like your guest is part of that studio experience too. You know what would be great is if we could show this to people right now. I, I would love to, you know, the guests we have, they don't have green screens, they're not as sophisticated. We should get them working on that, we should tell them about that. But it'd be great if we could really do a whole test now, wouldn't it? I think it would be a great idea. Do you think our team could get this going now? What if we did something with somebody from New Tech? Well, I think that we have some people who would be uh, ready to talk about You know who I'd love show? to talk to? How about that guy Rex Olson? He's a legend. He's awesome. Rock star. He Rock is. star. Let's hey, get Adam, Rex. Adam, can you get <laughs> Rex on here? Can we make this happen? Uh, Rex is a rock star. He's a, he's a legend in the business. He does all the trade shows. People see him on the circuit. He does all the training. He is the new tech guy. Yes, he is, and I bet he knows a thing or two about talk show, too. I bet he does. <laughs> Adam, is this possible? Can we make this happen? Let's see. Oh, wow, there's Rex. How you doing, Rex? What? What a surprise. <laughs> uh, thanks for joining us, <laughs> just, Rex. This is uh, I just happened to be awesome. walking by, and, you know, your face came up on the monitor here, and <laughs> so here we are. Wow. So you are in uh, San Antonio, Texas, is that correct? Actually, no, I'm in our West Coast office okay. here in a uh, beautiful... Uh, New Tech City. You can see we've got a brand new world uh, corporate headquarters. In fact, I finally got an office with a window. I got this great <laughs> view outside. And you can see the sun's just coming up here in Los Angeles, California. But uh, I, yeah. I love that. That's that's sure. really awesome. And is that so? That's a virtual set. Is that a green screen you've got? Gr no, not a green screen at all. In fact, uh, you know, it's just an amazing uh, illusion that uh, <laughs> we were able to create. Um, oh. Oh, oh, where'd guess, it go? I guess it is a green screen. <laughs> Pretty wrinkly one at that. I, lo I, lo I love Rex, and he's got such a great sense of humor, too. Uh, Rex, talk about uh, talk show. I mean, first of all, what are people seeing on your side? So everybody knows what we're seeing on this side. What do you see on your side from us? Well, I happen to have a talk show on my end. Uh, uh, the previous call that you just did with Israel was uh, obviously using their laptop camera, webcam. But in my case, I have a talk show, and I'm feeding it with a uh, TriCaster here. And by doing that, you're able to get the high-quality input on both ends of the call. So really, you are getting effectively what has been used by uh, broadcast news for many, many years, uh, only at a very, very affordable level using Skype. And it enables you to interview guests from anywhere in the world. Uh, what I think of this as only, uh, to me, as only a broadcast solution, right? Um, it's for live streaming like this or broadcast, but I know, I know there are many other applications for it that are great. I mean, obviously we see the benefits here for, for a broadcast, but what other benefits are there for, what other applications is it good for? One of the biggest uh, that we would see is uh, in enterprise, in the enterprise world, when you have a company that has multiple locations, but they're doing their live meeting, um, they can have somebody from one location Skyping in. But if, they're, if they have a green screen re behind them, it might as well be from the same location, and people are doing this. Well, what's interesting is, so I have a, uh, first of all, your green screen looks amazing. It's really hard to get green screens to look that good. It, it's not when you're using a TriCaster and your software, but in reality for uh, everything else to get virtual sets and green screens to look good, it's very hard. In this case, you're able to do it uh, remarkably well. And, and we, we are starting to fool with that with the TriCaster a little bit as well. 
But uh, I think we had a client for the video production company that said, hey, we want to sell to a lot of people at one time. So maybe we want to sell to this client, that client, and that client, and then not only sell, but then do training to them all at the same time. And we want to have a nice looking set. How could we do this? And how could we do it and distribute it to all these people? And this was like two or three years ago, and it was really tough, and you had to have a lot of hardware, and they wanted to do multiple cameras, so they got a TriCaster, but you still had to have multiple, you know, things and I'm not a big fan of virtual sets but I think the virtual sets and the way you guys do it are at the point where they can do this and I see it now as a great corporate communications tool especially when you have meetings and people in different places but also for uh, sales well you know it's true it talk show does make it easy because it can integrate so nicely with TriCaster to have that green screen but you don't need to have a green screen you don't need need to have a talk show right. on both sides in order to get that communication well, out I guess that's what I was saying is Rex what do people see I know you were explaining what your interface is but what do people see if if you were just using a laptop or you were using what you use what do people see on your end of the Skype uh, well in this case I'm seeing your camera feed uh, because obviously you're sending it back through New Tech Talk Show um, through the SDI input. So any standard production equipment, uh, you can send a auxiliary feed or a program feed so that I can watch the same program that either everyone else is watching or you can send me an isolated feed. In this case, I'm just seeing you. So I'm just having a regular conversation as you normally would on any Skype or any video call. With talk show, you get to decide what that remote guest sees on their end. They're not just seeing your webcam like they would with a Skype client. They're seeing whatever you want to send back to them. I, I think it's just so amazing and so awesome. Uh, I love I love it. I love talk show. I love everything you guys do. Thank you guys so much. Rex, I got to thank you so much for joining us from uh, California via Skype. Uh, I hope you'll join us again tomorrow when uh, Ellen comes back on to talk TriCaster a little bit uh, or at some other point before this is over. But thank you for your time. It's an honor and a privilege to meet you over Skype. I hope we get to meet in person at some point. Uh, you're a legend in the business and with New Tech, and it, it's an honor to have you on. And, and we love New Tech, and so it's an honor to have you guys on and be part of this as well. Thank you, Ellen, to you too for coming on. I look forward to having you on tomorrow. Great. See you soon, Michael. Thanks, Rex. Great. Thanks for having me. We'll Thank be you. back with a whole lot more from your live continuing digital signage Infocom 2015 continuing coverage on Be Terrific right after this. Don't go anywhere. You're the Terrifics and you make Be Terrific special. Stay with us.